Either it's hot or it's cold. Either it's sunny or it's raining. The one thing that always stays constant throughout everything. Rationalization of saying goodbye. Thought of even uttering it. It sends shivers down my spine. When I say goodbye, I wish it meant something. Put up with too much over the past fucking 32 years of my life. I put up with too much shit. I've seen the good, the bad, and the fucking strange. But I have been dealt with the depression. I suffer from depression so much that no one ever even contemplates how bad I suffer from it. Doctors, friends, family, relatives, they don't even know the fucking pain that has been inflicted inside me. Like a sailboat rocking along the waves. I wish the wind would just blow my sails down so I can just turn over. I guess it's way past overdue. But I'm glad that people are gone. I wish I was gone. I really do. I wish I didn't have to tell anyone. But I have to. Because being selfish and not telling anyone it breaks people's hearts. It breaks people's lives. Rips them right down the center. Rips them apart. And as they're struggling to grasp the situation, it's already too late. The damage has already been done. We live in a fucking wasteland. We live in a fucking hostile wasteland. There's nothing great about life anymore. It's all a bunch of lies on top of other lies. It's all a bunch of nonsense. There's nothing great when all your greatness has been sucked out of you.
and you're left in a, as a fucking empty husk. An empty room. An empty void. You know, people say that I could do, people say they could deal with their problems and make the best of the situations. There's too many problems for me to just even bat an eyelash at. The problems I am dealing with is people. I'm dealing with people. I can't stand people. can't stand people. I hate to say it. I don't mean to be a mean person when I say this. But I can't stand the way things are turning out. Sometimes there's days where I just don't want to get up out of bed and maybe sleep in until 10. Hearing my fucking alarm go off, I'm just like, it's just another day. I tell myself this lie to wake up and put a fucking smile on my face. Hoping that people would get the picture, get the message, get the understanding. But instead, they get one side. They don't get the full side. They don't get the full aspect on how fucked up things have really gotten. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me talking. Or just analyzing things. But it seems to me that people really have a vindictive side to themselves. And what seem as support and what seem as friendly banter, friendly chatter, it's really just a temporary fix. A temporary fix to something that can never be fixed. I can't keep doing this to everyone. I can't keep doing this to myself. I either need to suck it up and just go go forward in, with doing it. Say goodbye for one last time. Say peace. I can't take another day. Or another night. I'm just too old. I'm too old, too tired, too exhausted. I hope everyone fucking cries. I really do. I hope they fucking cry their hearts out. Cause I'll laugh. When my days come to a final end. I 
to go backwards. They never go forwards. They stop. There's a stopping point. There's a rest stop. There's a stopping point. You can tell yourself one or two things. Keep going or just stop. Just stop. But I already made my bed. I got up. I already did what I wanted to do, which was cut short. So now what? Wait for others to catch up. Or just sit here. And hope that one day luck finds its way. You're like an unlucky person. Maybe I'm ungrateful. Maybe I'm selfish. Maybe I'm a list of other things. But I know what I'm not. And I know what I'm not. What others may assume but there's things that I can't talk about because it's really going to offend a lot of people it has nothing to do with anything about normal day society it has to do with life and death there's things that i want to talk about there's things i want to get off my chest there's things i want others to know before it's too late i don't want them to joke about it but i'd rather see them dance at my fucking funeral and dance to the very fucking end. If they can make it to the very end and look back on everything and tell themselves it was worth it every last moment was worth it. If they have no sins, no guilt to hide, no shame in saying goodbye, then say it. Just say it. Say goodbye. Leave it as is. Say goodbye. Say your peace. And be gone. Shut the coffin and set it on fire.
reality of things. People don't like to talk about the negative sides of life, which is death. But never in a million years would I think about burning a flag. But I thought about it. Not burning my country's state, state flag, but burning another flag. Never in a million years would I think about burning a flag. For some odd reason, you know, it never really dawned on me to really give a two shits of what what people's lifestyles are. You know, because I've never really cared about people, to be honest. And they never really cared about me, so... It wasn't like I was hurting anyone. I was just hurting myself. Day in, day out. And I finally got to the point where I had enough. I had enough of it. Just go with the motions, go with the flow. Go where you, go where you think you need to go. But deep down, you can't vanish without saying goodbye. That's what I told myself. Can't go anywhere without saying goodbye. So say goodbye. If you can say goodbye and it doesn't hurt you to say goodbye, then you might be that close to me to understand. But if you can say goodbye and it hurts you to say goodbye, then you have been affected. And I can't help you. I don't wanna help you. I don't wanna help myself. I don't wanna ask for help anymore. I just wanna go down the ship. Everyone can panic and freak out all they want. But I just want to watch it go down. I don't want to be the monster in everyone's nightmares. I'm the monster in my own nightmare. Everyone says that being brave, being bold, and being courageous, and speaking out makes volumes, makes ripples in the water. Yeah, it does. But sometimes the words never get out. The videos never get out. The truth never gets out. It's always covered up, bandaged up, wrapped up, sealed up, shut in, closed up, boarded up. It never gets out. But when it does get out, And the fire's too great to stop. You just watch it burn. You watch it smolder. The 
embers. Do you put it out or do you just keep adding on to it? Some people add on to it. Me, I stop adding on to my fire. My fire is just smoldering smoke. There's no warmth to it anymore. There's no warmth in my heart anymore. You all lost. Congratulations. Whether you want to accept it or not, you all lost. So I feed you. I do. I bid you a farewell. I say goodbye. And hope in a million years I don't see you ever again. I won't last for a million years. How I don't even know if I'm gonna last for this fucking year. But I count the years. Till the day. I counted. I've watched. I've waited. I sat back to see what would happen. And all it got me was lint in my pocket and a lucky guitar pick. Sometimes people can sense things happening before it happens. Some people wake up and notice that today doesn't feel right. There's something off. There's something odd. It doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel normal. Was it just me? Because I overslept today. I overslept today, so I needed a little bit more sleep. I cherish my sleep. I don't get enough of it. If I could sleep all day, sleep all night, And all I'm doing is sleeping. But don't let this deceive, de de deceive you. Don't let this discourage you at all. Hearing my voice. last thing you're gonna fucking hear. It's the only thing you're gonna hear. It may haunt you. It may give you nightmares. You may be tossing and turning in your, in your bed 
or wherever you are, feeling sick in your stomach, your ears burning. <clears throat> but when death comes to your door, it says it's time to go. Smile. And cherish a memory. One single memory. Because time is too short. No one knows when their time is up. Some people do. And it wasn't wrong for them to say goodbye too soon. I think it was genuine. They knew they couldn't fix what can it be fixed? They, they knew it was food bar to begin with. They knew it was a... A disaster just waiting to happen. They knew. But yet they still went through with it. People make me sick. People are strange. So goodbye to my friends, goodbye to my family. If I ever do talk again, I hope it's on a brighter day. Goodbye.